Hey guys, it's Martin Brooks here. And today I'm going to show you a really simple cloning or ghosting effect that you often see in some music videos. So let's go. I'm here now with Premiere Pro open. On my timeline, I have this video here. The first thing we're going to do, we're going to duplicate this video. Press the Alt key, click on the video, and drag. Now you have two clips. The second video has to be above the first. Now we're going to change the speed of this second clip. Click on the clip with the right button and then select the speed duration option. We have to slow down the video, so I'm going to set the value to 95%. Remembering that you can put the value that you think is best. It doesn't have to be 95%. The lower the value, the greater the effect will be on the video. Press OK. Perfect. We will now decide where the effect starts and ends. I want the effect to start here so I'm going to click and drag the second video a little bit. Here's good for me. I will do the same in the end. This is where the effect will end. In effects control, let's change the opacity to 50%. Then look for the cross dissolve effect. Use this effect at the beginning and end of the second clip and this is going to make the effect fade in and out really smooth. So I'm just going to shorten this just a little bit. You can adjust this however you like. Finally, let's see how our video is turning out. And that looks pretty good to me. Turn down for what? If I don't like the way that this effect looks right now, what I can do is again, right click, go down to speed duration and I can change this number down to whatever I like. It doesn't have to be 95%. You can change, for example, for 90%. Is going to be a lot more dramatic so. You just got to play around with this number and see what's going to work best for your specific clip, alright? One more thing. The more movement action you have in your scene, the more the effect will be visible. This explains why it is often used in music and sports videos. So, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give us a like and check out more on Hey Videos tutorials. Remembering that all the footage I use in this video is from Envato. Lots of templates, website themes, photos, videos, or audio. Everything you need to improve your video can be found here. I will put the link in the description. If you have any questions, please comment below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.